Hello, my name is Dr. Sam High. I'm an internal medicine doctor. Thank you so much for watching and welcome to Raw Talk. This is episode number 58. Raw Talk is unfiltered and unedited. I give you my thoughts and opinions on health. In this episode, I will be talking about carnivore for kids. Should kids eat carnivore? The truth about children and meat-based diets. But first, a quick announcement. I want to in interview carnivores for this channel. Your story will inspire those who are in your situation to change. If you are interested, send me an email, drsamhigh at gmail.com. See the description for the correct spelling. Okay, we've all heard the advice. Kids need a balanced diet. Whole grains, fruits, vegetables, low-fat dairy, lean meats. That's the standard message. But what if I told you that the so-called balanced diet is part of the reason kids today are sicker, fatter, and more inflamed than ever before? Obesity, ADHD, autoimmune diseases, allergies, asthma, all skyrocketing in children. And yet we keep doubling down on the food pyramid for kids. Here's the truth. Kids don't need a plant-based balanced diet. Kids need nutrient-dense animal foods. Today, we're going to answer the controversial question, should kids eat carnivore? And I'll show you why a meat-based diet may be one of the best things you can do for a growing child's health. Kids are not just small adults. Their nutritional needs are different and in some ways higher. Let's talk about protein. Growth requires amino acids, muscle, bone, connective tissue, enzymes, neurotransmitters, all built from protein. Animal protein has the highest biological value. It contains all essential amino acids in the right ratios. What about fat? Children's brains are still developing. The brain is about 60% fat by weight, with DHA and cholesterol playing huge roles. Saturated fat and cholesterol, demonized in adults, are critical for brain development and hormones in kids. What about micronutrients? Iron, zinc, vitamin A, B12, calcium, magnesium, phosphorus. These are best absorbed from animal foods. Iron from steak, heme iron versus iron from spinach, which is non-heme, poorly absorbed. The bottom line is that Kids need abundant protein, healthy fat, and bioavailable micronutrients. And that means animal foods. So why are kids today struggling more than ever? Because the food pyramid for kids is upside down. Grains like pasta, bread, cereal, spikes in blood sugar and insulin, seed oils in chips, crackers, fried foods. That drives inflammation. Low-fat dairy strips away the very fats that kids' brains need. Vegetables and fruits marketed as nutrient-dense, but loaded with anti-nutrients, oxalates, lectins, phytates, that block absorption. And the result? Kids are overfed on calories, underfed on nutrients. Rising obesity, more cavities, more ADHD, more autoimmune disease, anxiety and depression starting earlier than ever. This is not genetics. This is nutrition. Now let's look at the flip side. What happens when kids eat primarily animal foods? They have stable energy, no sugar crashes, no hyperactive spikes. Carnivore kids often have calm, stable moods. They have strong growth. High-quality protein builds lean muscle and bone. 
fat fuels the brain and hormones. They have fewer allergies and asthma. Removing grains and processed food lowers systemic inflammation. Many kids see improvements in eczema, asthma, chronic ear infections. They also have better teeth and jaws. Meat-based diets encourage proper jaw development. Less sugar means less and fewer cavities. Weston A. Price documented this in traditional cultures. Kids also have improved, improved focus and mood. Parents often report better behavior, less ADH-like symptoms, more steady emotions. This isn't theoretical. I've seen it firsthand, and there are thousands of anecdotal reports of kids thriving on animal-based diets. Now, is the lion diet for kids? Here's an important nuance. Lion diet, just beef, salt, and water, is designed for adults with severe autoimmune disease. For kids, that level of restriction usually isn't necessary unless they have crippling autoimmune or gut issues. But a broader carnivore animal-based diet with meat, eggs, seafood, and maybe some raw dairy if tolerated is totally viable for kids. Kids can thrive on nutrient-dense animal foods without needing broccoli, bread, or fruit snacks. Let's be real. Kids live in a world full of junk food. Birthday parties, school lunches, social events. 100% strict carnivore may be unrealistic for most families. But a baseline of meat, eggs, fish, and animal fat at home sets the foundation. Occasional fruit or honey? That's fine for most healthy kids. But these are treats, not staples. The goal isn't dogma. The goal is raising strong, healthy, resilient kids who aren't metabolically broken by the age of 12. You'll hear pushback. Kids need fiber. That's false. There's no physiological requirement for fiber. Kids' guts are not deficient in Metamucil. They need nutrients. Kids need fruits and vegetables for vitamins. Animal foods provide all essential vitamins and minerals, often in more bioavailable forms. It's unsafe to cut out food groups. We're not cutting out. We're cutting out the junk. What's left is the most nutrient-dense food on the planet. They'll say it's restrictive. Compared to what? Obesity, asthma, cavities, ADHD meds? That's restrictive. A meat-based diet is liberating. If you're a parent, you've been sold a lie. The lie that your kids need cereal, juice, and whole grains to be healthy. That low-fat milk is essential. That animal foods are dangerous. Look at the results. Sicker kids. Heavier kids. More medicated kids. Now look at nature. For hundreds of thousands of years, children were raised on meat, milk from their mothers, eggs, fish, and fat. And they grew tall, strong, and healthy without an epidemic of cavities, asthma, or ADHD. The truth is simple. Kids thrive on animal foods. They don't need a balanced diet of processed carbs and plant toxins. They need the nutrition nature designed for them. So, should kids eat carnivore? Not necessarily the strict lion diet, but absolutely. Kids can thrive on a carnivore or animal-based diet built on meat, fat, eggs, fish, and if tolerated, raw dairy. It's the most nutrient-dense healing foundation you can give your child. And it may be the single most important decision you make for their long-term health. If you're ready to stop feeding your kids the lies of the food pyramid, 
and start giving them real human food. Join me inside my 90-day carnivore blueprint. You'll learn exactly how to build this foundation for yourself and for your family. Thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate all of you. If you want to follow me for more content on Instagram, my username is Sam underscore high MD. Once again, thank you guys. I love you. And I will see you in the next video.